There is a game that is waiting to be released. Awakened Evil is a Castlevania inspired game that is going to be released sometime during this year. You can find the demo at itch.io. The demo is way too short, only one stage and that's about it. The graphics are too pixelated and basic. That is however, compensated by the added 3D effects on the stages. But unfortunately, not even that can circumvent how uninspired some graphics are. Just look at the beginning of stage 1, or the main hero. They look an awful lot like a game with multiple names depending on the region. You guessed it, it looks a lot like Castlevania Vampire's Kiss, or Dracula X, as the angry nerdy fat yanks would call it. Or Devil's Castle Dracula Double X which is how the Japanese VTubing chicks would call it, assuming the game is on the Switch Online service. The only difference would be that they would say the name with an over-the-top cute voice, and of course, in English. Don't get us wrong. If you get money by being a mukbanger, then keep going. And if you get simp money for pretending to be an anime character, then more power to you. And of course, if you decide to be less of a man, by feeding your family with immature behavior in the form of a monetized video that you didn't even produce, then that is up to you, my middle-aged sir. Anyways, as you can see, the similarities between Awakened Evil and Vampire's Kiss are clear as your biological gender. Awakened Evil's main character has some blue on his clothes, just like Castlevania's Richter Belmont. And the first stage of Awakened Evil looks just like Vampire's Kiss first stage as well. We hope that these almost plagiarized ideas get at least a different coat of paint. If we want to play a gothic game with a hero in blue, then we'll just play Rondo of Blood instead. That being said, Awakened Evil is a respectable indie game that is most likely going to be worth the time and money you would spend with it.